Okay, what's going on? What's going on guys? It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been about a week that you guys saw uh, that you guys saw the the patio and the front slab little slab by the window well poured with Tino and Fonzie but uh, we actually haven't been doing nothing we've been um, out of town and um, we've been working but you know now we got back um, it's Monday today um, it's raining we are actually off here all the guys are off Ryan gave us off so um, I had already a, a little side a little side job coming up and I was like you know what let me just do it this day but it started raining so it's raining the whole day today in the morning right now it's one o'clock in the afternoon we're gonna go get a skid steer to rent uh, first got to stop at the bank deposit some money in the account and we should be going we should we should have the funds and everything and um, see if they even got a skid steer that's the thing that's a problem if they got a skid steer if they don't well I'm be in trouble uh, other than that um, uh, yeah thanks for all the support uh, we're almost in the end of the season it's no it's September October and November November we stopped working so yeah it's only been it's only gonna be two months but it's gonna be crazy because it's coming quicker than what I expected but we're gonna keep busy probably in winter I'm not I'm not so sure right now but we will I'm trying to do something really cool for you guys figure out what I gotta do what I gotta buy but I'll just you guys be surprised when I do it but thank you guys for all <clears throat> the support all the people watching I know there's a lot of comments be like oh keep it English keep it English I am going to keep it English so you know it's it's hard for me to uh, to say that you know when I'm working with Tino and Fonzie Fonzie really doesn't understand English like that so it's harder for me to express myself in English than in Spanish so <clears throat> obviously you guys could tell because I had struggled a little bit pronouncing words that I really don't know how to express myself but I'll try my hardest to keep it English um, other than that we're gonna go get the skid steer and yeah we're gonna go drop off the skid steer to the job and probably start breaking it but um, see you guys in a bit thanks for watching the easy e channel I'll see you guys in a little bit thanks for watching all right we got really bad news so um like once again they do not have nothing in stock united rental it's not them it's just the people that rent them but we're gonna we're gonna go try home depot and see if they have some i know i don't like renting from home depot but i gotta do what i gotta do but i'll see you guys after this one if not i just gotta go <laughs> i gotta ask for ryan if he could rent me a small one if what's go like if i could rent one of them you know but we'll see <clears throat> well, I'll see you guys in a bit. It's a bummer, but there's always a solution. So we went to Home Depot. They actually do have some, but the pricing is outrageous. How much they're charging to rent for one day? It is around roughly $500 for a small skid steer, guys. So that's a lot of money. Just, just crazy how everything's just going. Blah, 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 up. But, um. I knew where Ryan was, so I went over there and said what's up to him. He was putting some stuff, being busy. And actually, I am gonna rent one of his skid steers. So let's see if he uh, wants to rent one. But yeah, he said yes. And I'm just getting the Bobcat. So I'm gonna rent the big track machine again, but I really don't need a big track machine, but that's all he has right now available for us. Well, for me, available for me. So um, I'm just gonna go pick up the skid steer. The Bobcat 3T20. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy just how much they want. Soon I really wanted it. You know, it just never it never goes as planned as you want. You know, I was looking at the skid steer. I couldn't do it. You know, it's just too much money. Right now they're asking winters around the corner. I need to have some money saved for that and for some taxes. <clears throat> But we're gonna go probably next year if everything goes good with you guys everything's going good we're probably gonna get a a skid steer next year we just gotta see what what happens what god brings us so um yeah not bummed out you know gotta go drop off the new haul and then get the skid loader yeah so i gotta go get some chains i just made it to my yard i gotta pick up my breaker 
because if I don't get a breaker, how am I gonna break the asphalt? It's super easy to asphalt to break. You guys are gonna be funny. It's gonna be funny. But we got this pretty much. Ow, I got the back one already done. Pretty much is just put in place. I just gotta open my gate, the breaker, put it on, and we go get some stuff from here. I need a shovel, pickaxe, and that's it. Go right now. Hello guys. Just pickaxe and a shovel. Square. this one I like this one and that's about it that's all we need right now um yeah let's get it down let's get it down and yeah that gravel I still got it so they think it was sand I don't know why people think it was sand Alright, we got everything good. Now we're just gonna go and start the job. Break it. Start breaking it. Come back and drop the stuff down. But yeah. Like I was saying, uh, we got the bobcat in the trailer, got the breaker in, got my shovel and a pick that I'm gonna use to put the asphalt in. Oh, we should be good, man. Super easy. I can't believe they haven't even got gravel, man. That was like concrete. They not even gravel. What if I needed gravel? I have to go to this thing up. So we're heading over there. It's like seven minutes away. It's super close. Oh, so that's, that's a plus sign. We'll be back. I'll see you guys in a bit. When I get there and start the job, I'll show you guys what's going on. So I just finished taking this off. I actually just arrived here. It's not this house, it's it's in the alley. It's pretty calm here actually. Despite being in the north side. This is not like the north side, it's like literally across Butler. start I can't even start because there's a truck there dude <sighs> I gotta call Judy I hate when everything just goes not as planned I just love it. came in, moved the truck. We start, I actually start.
gravel out of here. Out here a few times in the, in the ice and snow. Yeah, no. Have enough grip on the concrete. Yeah. The broom will be nice. Mm -hmm. All right, man. I'll be back. Okay. You'll be here, right? Yeah, I'll be here. All right, man. So that was Richard. He's actually the guy that keeps maintenance guys basically for the home rental properties. I actually doing this for the lady. Um, we're gonna go get this dump truck and uh, we're gonna park this at my yard because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna take this back soon like really soon I don't even need a lot so take this back bring the dump truck and then come get it and then yeah so this is pretty simple guys it's just a quick uh it's a quick A quick one, two, three. I gotta. I'll just put that one to go over there. Yeah, we're in the north side, so it's pretty. It's not too dangerous here. It's really calm, but going down more over there. I don't. I do not work over there, so yeah. This is just the farthest I probably ever do. So we'll be over there. We're gonna go get the dump truck, come back, and then start loading it up. So I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm gonna go and get the dump truck, so I'll be back. We're heading out. We actually got the dump truck. We're gonna go dispose this gravel. It's wet, it's too wet, so. Get rid of 
this gravel. this little ass fall out of here and then that's it for today
done taking all the asphalt out it's like this thin so I gotta go dump it and then I have to come in tomorrow and dig it out I'm gonna get the little bucket that Ryan has in the shop or in the yard a uh, little four footer and then I think that's will be good you know get the get the stuff that I really need I need to go drop off the I don't even think I'm gonna drop it off I'm just, no I gotta drop it off so I gotta drop off the the trailer and yeah I gotta go home pretty good i wasn't planning to start today like the guy said i was planning to start tomorrow but i was like man what hey what the heck you know i'm already here might as well just start it broke it boom let's go so i'm gonna leave i'll see you guys in a bit well, i'll see you guys later if i don't see you guys but i'll see you guys thanks for watching just got done um taking the stuff back dropping the trailer i'm out of here it was a long day today yeah right but um, thanks for watching everybody i know i've been slacking on videos but we're back at it we're going to try to see a lot of things we're going to do a lot of things to this dually we're going to try to keep you guys entertained um thanks for everybody out everybody watching the use easy channel the victory channel the, everybody be watching the easy channel thank you guys um we will keep it more english for you guys sorry about that but um, other than that we're going to get out of here i'll see you guys on the next one when we pour it or tomorrow I'll see you guys on the next one, which is tomorrow. Grade it, put wire mesh and, you know, suspension foam and all that thing. So I'll see you guys in a bit. See you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Nos vemos. Adios.